My homily for the 30th Sunday in Ordinary Time, the 24th of October, 2021. Our first reading today is one of those messianic readings from the Old Testament, telling us what will happen when the Messiah, the Saviour, comes. It was addressed to a defeated, exiled people, giving them a message of hope, promising them that they will return to the promised land. It mentions, as it often does, the blind and the lame, those who are weak and marginalised, They in particular will be comforted and strengthened when the Messiah comes. Our psalm continues in the same way, speaking of the marvels that the Lord has worked, speaking of a situation transformed. Those who are sowing in tears will sing when they reap. All the messianic passages are uplifting and encouraging, a very positive message for then and now. In our gospel, we meet Bartimaeus, a blind beggar. He recognises Jesus as the Messiah, giving him the messianic title, Son of David. He shouts out when he knows Jesus is near. Bartimaeus is a great example to us of perseverance in prayer and in witnessing to Jesus as Saviour. People scold him and tell him to keep quiet, but he only shouted all the louder. He is not put off by what others think or say. Bartimaeus asked Jesus to let him see again, and that's exactly what Jesus did. He opened his eyes and noticed what Bartimaeus did then. He followed Jesus along the road. His life is transformed. Not only can he see, but he becomes a follower of Jesus. Truly, Jesus has the power to transform our lives. Whatever the outward circumstances, he can help us to see things in a new way. A wonderful miracle, a deeply symbolic miracle. Bartimaeus was blind but he could still see who Jesus was, the son of David, the Messiah and Saviour. Many of those around him who could see with their eyes were unable to see who Jesus was. The eyes are crucial, we would say, and yet there are still blind people who live very full lives. But there is another sight, an inner sight, that enables to look at things in a different way, the sight of faith. It enables us to see good things, wholesome things, even in the most difficult situations. O Lord, that we may see with the sight of faith.